um, we're so many different cultures, different, you get bamboos, damaras, hereros, but like we don't now place ourselves and like, no, you are damara, go hang with your friends or whatever. We just work together and yeah. We are beautiful, powerful, smart, confident. We're everything that any guy would need and any guy would want. It's that special time again for me to shoot my all-time favorite episode. I mean, what is so special about African women? I know most of you normally say you hug too much. Why are you hugging every woman? Come on. Hug makes people comfortable around me. I always have ways to make people comfortable whenever I'm talking to them. So I don't know why you always have to go against my hugs. But hey, in this video, I'm going to try as much as possible not to hug any single woman. I mean, it's going to be a hard task, but I'm going to try. What is so unique about Namibian women? You know, my first ever episode during the Africa to the World was what is so unique about Ethiopian women. And the video has over a million views right now. Hello. Uh, yeah, um, man, I forgot my... Indignous? <laughs> okay, okay. So, uh, okay. Yeah, salam. So, which means people really love this. And some of you are saying, why don't I ask guys about what is so unique about their men? I don't think if you ask a guy what is so unique about their men, they're going to tell you the truth. So you need to go meet the women and ask them yourself. So, hey, I'm just going to do that special episode today. And I'm here in Namibia University of Science and Technology to ask what is so unique about Namibia women. Stay tuned, like the video, subscribe, and be part of this awesome family. Hi, my name is Maya from Ghana. Tell me your name and where you from? Hi, my name is Maria Shkolele and I am from Namibia. My name is Martha. <laughs> Martha? Yeah, I'm from Namibia. Uh, my name is Kabe Okorwa, I'm from Namibia. Uh, Betty Namuya from Namibia. Uh, Cecilia from Namibia. Cecilia from Namibia. You're the yeah. first person that I got to know that her name is Cecilia from Namibia. I thought Cecilia has always come from Ghana. No. You're not from Ghana? I'm not. Your height is just like a Ghanaian woman. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we want to know what makes Namibian women so unique? Um, I feel like the way that we embrace our culture makes us extremely unique. Like on everyday life, you can see Namibian women wearing their cultural attire. Like it's just an everyday thing for us. We're proud to be who we are, basically, because there are a lot of diverse cultures in Namibia, and we all embrace each of them. Are you Himba? No, I'm not. I would love you to be Himba. You know, maybe you're not Himba, eh? No, I'm not. <laughs> oh my God, which tribe are you? I am Oshuambo. Oshuambo. Yes. Ngapi. Mm. Nga is it Ngapi or Nawa? That's Kavango. Okay, I feel like most of all our, you know, differentiated cultures just make um, uh, make us, I don't know, uh, a better part of us that makes us, you know, beautiful, unique, different from, you know, the whole world or from uh, any other African woman. Um, and the fact that we are maybe self-driven and that we want to be successful, you know, the fact that we just want each and every Namibian woman or yeah, Namibian person wants to be successful and mostly the woman and we are not criticized by the yeah. One of the things that make Namibian women unique is the empowerment. Namibian women empower one another, they are emancipated, they believe in working together, working with each other, building each other up and growing each other. They believe in letting the past go and try to move in the like future. You know, in the future, I mean. That's so beautiful. Thank you. Wow, I, I, I can't wait to get myself a Namibian woman. <laughs> we just want to know what makes Namibia so unique. Namibia is unique because... No, sorry. I even forgot my question. You know what? Her beauty just confused me. I'm so sorry about that. What makes Namibian women so unique? Um, as, like my friend said before, we're diverse, we're smart, we're beautiful, we're strong, we're powerful. We are everything that anyone would want and anyone would need so i would definitely recommend a namibian girl um, well there's diversity um with so many different cultures and mm. the thing is you can see with me and my friends we get along so well we are different you get bamboos damaras heroes but like we don't now place ourselves and like no you are damara go hang with your friends or whatever we just work together and yeah that's the one thing that i really appreciate and love about this one country this and we're beautiful you see, oh. look, you see. So beautiful Namibian women. <laughs> yeah. But do beautiful Namibian women date outside Namibia? Um yeah. Yeah, we are do. You, are you dating outside of Namibia right now? Um <laughs> I have. You ha I mean are you dating outside Namibia right no, now? No, no, no. 
but have you ever dated outside Namibia yes, before? Yes, I have. Which country was that? Um, <clears throat> <clears throat> I think it's, I, I don't think. No, 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 I mean, like, which country was that? Uh, <clears throat> it was, it was, <clears throat> no, no. No, I don't which want... <laughs> country was that? I don't want to answer the question. No, 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 because we need to give them a shout out. Which country was that? Um, yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, calm down. Wait, okay, wait, no, wait. Um, from Angola. From Angola? Yeah. How was it? It was it was okay, I guess. It was a beautiful experience. Mm -hmm. Would you ever try it again? Um, sure, but not, yeah. Which other African country that you would love to date from? Oh, like from South Africa, like they're really attractive people there. My brothers from South Africa, are you watching this video right now? I'm just gonna put it on Instagram, but hey, please, chill. Take a chill pill, man. Take it slowly. Yeah, they do. I feel like just um, the country where you're from or the place where you're from does not determine the people you should date. If if you like someone from abroad or from another country, you, you surely can. Uh, my next question is, are you single? <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> are you dating someone from Namibia or outside Namibia? From Namibia. How, how, how does it taste like? How does it? Taste like? Um, I feel like... I know the same as I would be dating someone from elsewhere. It's just the same. It's you know uh, a person is most unique on uh, uh, what in what uh, does not does not uh, matter if it's you know if whatever culture you are or bamboo or Namibian uh, American. It's just people are unique in their own ways. So tell us something about Namibian men um, that you love so much. Hmm. Really can't say I don't really know much about the men. <laughs> you don't know what makes a man unique? Um Wow. No. Wow. <laughs> wow. Now you know why I don't ask men how unique their women are. You know, because she doesn't know. Only them will know, yeah. Men date out of Namibia. Yes. Are you dating out of Namibia right now? No, unfortunately not. Are you dating inside Namibia right now? No. Why? Have you ever dated before? No, I haven't dated before. No, that is so hard to, I mean... <laughs> do you guys believe it? <laughs> why? why? Um, because, my firstly, when I was younger, my parents didn't allow it. It was mm -hmm. a strict rule. And then secondly, um, I feel like relationships have... The meaning of relationships have changed so much. Mm -hmm. And people just get into relationships just to be in a relationship. I feel like a relationship needs commitment and I'm not ready to fully commit to someone yet. When will you be ready? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Yes, we do. Yeah, we do date out of Namibia. <laughs> Are you dating out of Namibia right now? I, that is confidential information. No, they just want to know. Are you dating out of Namibia right now? I am open to dating out of Namibia. What about now? Is I it in not, Namibia? Apparently, I am not. So are you single right now? Yes, I am. So you think I should put your Instagram for someone to reach out to you? You can go ahead. <laughs> you can go ahead. <laughs> Why should somebody out there marry a lady from Namibia? <laughs> no, then they can go ahead and hit me up on Instagram at um, e.tuhole. My brother, feel free and shoot your shot. They do actually. You find a lot of Namibian women having men from another country than from Namibia. Are you dating out of Namibia? No, I'm actually single. Why are so many Namibian women single? Because the Namibian men are not the ones we're looking for. We are waiting for you guys from abroad to come show us what you got. My brother, the, the, the door is open. The door yeah. is open. I, 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 she, I, I'm not single though. <laughs> But the door is open, yeah? yeah? Book that flight ticket and, my friend, visit Namibia. Come Maybe Namibia. you might find your future wife in here. Yeah. So, I mean, why should somebody out there marry a Namibian woman? The reason why a foreigner should marry a Namibian is, number one, is the beauty. The confidence, the self-love, wow. you understand? Wow. Yeah, that is why they should marry. I'm definitely... Wife material, everything, the cooking is on point. Because we're beautiful, we're intelligent, we're powerful, we know what we stand for, we know our rights, and yeah, man, we're great. Because we are, we are versed in what a woman should be, um, which is a mother, which is a caretaker, which is a provider. And then we're also very versed in um, being a strong, independent woman, someone that works, someone that is, um, that's chasing her dreams, that is doing everything she wants to do. If you're given the chance to change one thing, in Namibia as a woman, what will you change? Okay, I would feel like I would want to 
um, maybe increase on equality. I feel like, you know, we don't uh, really have that much equality because it's like women are supposed to do what or women can only do what or women should not do what, which I feel like is unfair because anyone can do whatever they want. So I think I would want to, you know, change the, the, what is this, the lack of equality that we have in Namibia, you know, just to increase it a little bit for at least 50-50% or something like that. But Namibia in general, I feel like as much as we are very diverse and um, open community, we have a lot of limitations as women in our country and I feel that that should change because if women had more power in our country, um, it would be a way better place. So which means women don't have enough power in the country? No, women have power. It's just I feel like if we could control more, if we could do more, if we were allowed to um, tap all the resources that we have here, a lot of things would go better. To be honest, nothing. I love the individual women that we find in Namibia. Everyone is different and we love something about it. We, we, don't, we don't judge here. We love what we see and what we see. You can see my Namibian beautiful women standing right there. They are all different and we do not judge them. We love them for who they are. Wow. Thank you so much for talking to me. You're welcome. I'm currently from Vintuk, but I am from the northern part. It seems everyone yeah. in Vintuk is from the north. Yeah, no. What? Almost everybody. Almost everybody's from there. I went to the <laughs> north and I really loved it. Me? Yeah, I want to. What wanna... did you go do in the north? I, I went to drink Tombo. You want to go drink okay. Tombo? Yeah, just for Tombo. How... Wait, how long were you in Namibia? I've been in Namibia for like 21 days now. Oh. Yeah, and okay. I... Yeah, I went to Swakop. I spent a night with the Himbas, okay. but unfortunately they wanted to give me a lady, you know, <laughs> to satisfy me, but I'm like, no, you know what, I'm not interested in that one. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next one. Ayya, Maya. <laughs>